Welcome back to my channel, my crystal kings and queens. So today is December 3rd, which marks the third day of our 25 days of crystals. And today's video is going to be focused on agates. So I have an agate slice here and I have an agate sphere. Uh, I actually, this was my first agate ever. And then I went to purchase my agate slice, which I'm so, so, so in love with as I am all of my crystals, duh. Uh, <laughs> but um, I can't say either one of these were inexpensive because you know what? They cost a pretty decent penny arm thought in a prayer. And <laughs> I'm just, I think I'm good on the agates for a little bit or at least uh, these types that I have, so. I'm also pretty sure that I have way more in my crystal units, but it has been such a time trying to locate all of the crystals that I want to share and show for this, you know, this 25 days of Christmas, like, or 25 days of crystals. It, I just have so many crystals. It makes no sense. I am just over it. <laughs> I'm like Jesus I had no idea like I had an idea that I have so many crystals like I obviously know and I keep track of it um, I have an app that allows me to snap pictures place them in there name them number them all of that type stuff weigh them just all kinds of great things but you talking about going through these crystal containers it is so real that I, you know, I have to pull back a little bit just to make sure that I don't get overwhelmed. So it's, it's going to be something else trying to get to all of the crystals that I need. Anyway, I don't want to bore y'all with that. Let's go ahead and get to talking about the two uh, beauties we got here. And I'll maybe run into my other agates sometime later. I have no clue. Anyway, um... So agates, they are said to promote stability, security, composure. Um, it generally helps with those of us that have so much on our plate that we're multitasking and we're, we're doing too much. We're just doing things that maybe aren't as necessary as other assignments or projects that we may need to complete so it kind of keeps you from I guess um how do I say it like it kind of keeps you from doing things that you don't necessarily need to do at that moment so it helps you more so to prioritize if that makes more sense um it's a really great stone for mothers uh for um, soon to be mothers for ladies that may be going through um, post pregnancy baby blues. Um, I know that's a really common thing, so it kind of helps to avoid that or just kind of stay clear of those types of emotions. And it's really a great use for um, pregnancy, like while you're pregnant, for us women, of course. Um, anyway, let me go ahead and show you. So this, when I got it, I don't, I can't recall if it was sitting upward or down. Either way, when you look at this geode slice or agate slice, you think it's just a normal, what people who don't know much about the crystal world consider rocks. So, um, yeah, it looks like just a simple, normal, natural rock, um, you know, with an exception of the pink hues and all of that great Chavez. <laughs> um, I really, really love the pink, though. Pink used to be uh, one of my most favorite colors, but I've grown more towards the earth tone, so I'm a neutral kind of girl. And um, I know it's my mom's favorite color, but I really, really love this and it actually reminded me of my mom so when I picked it up I was like wow look at the back of this this is gorgeous and then you're talking about flipping it over and you get even more beauty makes absolutely no sense so gorgeous so delicious looking and yummy like oh my god I feel like if this was a type of cake or icing 
I'd have probably one of the biggest toothaches ever. But I just think this is so beautiful, so pretty, so gorgeous. Um, this actually made its debut in a previous video of mine. Can't really think of what it is, but either way, I really, really like this. It's just so pretty and gorgeous to me. And this was the second agate ever that I actually purchased. Pretty darn expensive, but well worth it, I can say. Um, now, moving on to my agate sphere, you think the same. Not much to it, just this simple sphere with a bunch of little happenings going on there. And, you know, it's little dendritic moments. Then you got the general agate, you know, pattern that you'd see. And on to flipping it over, you have a lovely and beautiful inside here. I feel like it's almost like with looking at the base of this as well, the base of the slice, it's like don't judge a book by its cover, you know, because you never know what's inside until you read it. And you flip them over and you have two gorgeous beauties here. Like, how could you deny that? That's just so, so pretty. Turn that right there. And back to this lovely lady here. But yeah, this was my very first agate, let alone agate sphere. And I'm just extremely happy with its purchase. I knew the very first moment I saw this, I was like, I got to have it. And though I was on a budget, I was like, I don't mind, you know, spending maybe 20 or 30 over it. Like, I have to have this because no one else can. And I got it. So <laughs> that is my little cute. Uh, okay, I guess ain't, it's not trying to. Okay, there we go. So those are my two little agates there. Again, I'm pretty sure I got more, but you're talking about trying to find it right now. Ain't happening. You feel me? Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you all enjoy the rest of your day. Crystal kisses and royal blessings. Stay beautiful.